All right, guys, what's going on? DB here bringing you a video on what is Rap State Ohm. So, if you found this video, you're either wondering what is Rap State Ohm, or you accidentally stumbled on this video when looking into Olympus or Ohm. I'm not going to get into too much detail on what Olympus is. I'll just cover it briefly because I have other videos on it that I'll link in the description. For the most part, it is the original high APY staking rebase platform uh the you know the whole single stakes three three bonds nine nine all of that olympus is the one that came up with it time is a clone of olympus the new one that, ju that i just made a video on hector dao is a clone of ohm um and they're all on different networks that's kind of what they have going for them olympus is on the ethereum network it's very expensive not the coin the coin isn't that expensive. It's only $873, but the gas fees. So in order to get Olympus, you have to get Ethereum onto your wallet. In my case, I use MetaMask. Then you have to go to SushiSwap or Uniswap, and you swap Ethereum for Ohm. A swap is the most expensive type of transaction you can do, so it's going to cost quite a bit. Um, I think the cheapest I ever swapped on Ethereum was maybe $70 or $120. But that's just the first step. You swap, you get the coin, and you go to their website. You have to approve state, uh, approve the website of using your own. That roughly costs thirty to seventy dollars, and then you actually stake it. That'll cost roughly thirty to seventy dollars. So all in all, you're probably spending an extra two, three hundred dollars just to stake your own. In there comes Wrap Staked Ohm, and the way you get Wrap Staked Ohm is you go to Trader Joe's. It's not the only place to get it. It's the cheapest place to get it. Um. So if you come over here to Trader Joe's and let's say you've never been there, um, you see here it says wrong network when you go to connect your wallet. Um, if you connect your wallet to Ethereum, uh, it's going to tell you to switch to Avalanche chain. You press that button. It's actually going to manually add the network in for you. So that's a little hack for you guys so you don't have to go in here and create a custom RPC and things of that nature. Um, but yeah, connect your wallet to Trader Joe's, add the Avalanche network, and if you come over here and you just type 1, You'll see that it's worth 529 AVAX, which AVAX is in the 90s. So if you come over here, you'll see Wrap State Dome is worth $28,000. And there's a reason for that. The reason for that is what it is, what it does, and how, the, how that price is calculated. So I was actually doing it earlier, but I'm going to do it again for you guys. So come over here. If we go to the dashboard on Olympus, you'll see that the price of Ohm is 873 now point let me put that point 25 in there now you'll multiply that by the current index which is 32.56 32.56 and you see that you'll get 28,433 if you come on over here you'll see that that's pretty close to this price um and if you come to Trader Joe's you'll see that they're selling it for just slightly above the price that it should be worth which makes sense they're they're an exchange they you know got to make some sort of profit um but yeah now, the reason that that works out like that, what is this current index? The current index is how much staked ohm you would have earned if you started with one Olympus from the very first day that they launched this platform. And the reason that they created this is because they knew that Ethereum obviously is very expensive, so they were eventually going to make it cross-chain compatible. And there comes Avalanche, Wrap Staked Ohm. So if you buy Wrap Staked Ohm and you want to get it onto ethereum network it's actually much cheaper to just buy wrap sake ohm unwrap it and then just put it on ethereum network or just leave it in your wallet and eventually do that because the way that when you unwrap it it does the math by multiplying what however much wrap sake ohm you have multiplying it by this and that's how much staked ohm you'll end up getting so you don't necessarily have to move it immediately you can leave it there but if you're already staked like i am on here and you want to add those two together so the way you would do that is by using any swap so I'm on Avalanche Network that's where I got my wrap staked ohm so we're gonna switch this on over let me um, hit the dashboard router AVAX no okay I think I had to put the coin first no oh okay phantom mainnet we want to do AVAX mainnet here we go refresh this bit there okay that took way too long all right so in here you make sure you're on avalanche network avance avax mainnet and you want to put wrap staked ohm and we're going to bridge it to ethereum and it's going to automatically bridge it to your ethereum wallet that's why it's automatically selected there 
and then you just put however much um I think it's not getting my balance right now um let me see make sure I'm on the right one wrap stake ohm wrap stake ohm do I not I don't think I have any on this wallet oh no there it is yeah I do I just didn't add the coin 0 0.009 Three, four. So you would do this. It doesn't cost anything. I think at most you pay some gas fees, which are very cheap on Avalanche. You swap it. It'll automatically bridge it on over to your Ethereum network. And once you got it on Ethereum, if you come to the OM website, switch the Ethereum network. If you hit this little button up here, the I OM, um, and all it's also on mobile. So if you're on their page on mobile, you'll definitely see it there. Wrap staked ohm you press that you hit the unwrap button and it'll see it, you'll have an unwrap um a unwrappable balance so you can unwrap it but that's after you bridge it i'm not really trying to bridge it right now um i don't know what the gas fees are currently um let me uh make this bigger again but yeah i was just showing you guys where it is on both mobile and on computer by minimizing that so it gives it the mobile view but yeah um so once you bridge it on over with any swap and it arrives in your Ethereum wallet, you just hit this little I ohm thing, hit the wrap staked ohm, and then you hit this unwrap button, and now you can unwrap it, and it'll automatically be staked, and it'll do that math. So I have point, um, how much did I say I had? Um, point zero nine three four. So if we do that math, point zero nine three four. Come on over to their dashboard. We're gonna multiply this by the current index, which is 32. Whoops, 32.56. I have roughly 0.3 ohms, which makes sense because I only put about $200, like 250 something, and the price of ohm is in the 873s. So that actually makes a lot of sense why I have 0.3 staked ohm. But yeah, that's basically what wrapped staked ohm is. Um, it's just to avoid gas fees. It's a cross, um, cross chain compatible. Uh, version of staked ohm um, and essentially you unwrap it and it'll automatically be staked and then you know you could uh, have it here mixed with any wrap uh, any staked ohm you already have um, when I first heard of it I thought it was this much more elaborate profitable version of ohm that gains some different way you know it's, it's actually very simple and it's actually very intelligent that they did that um, that just lets me know that it gave me more faith in Olympus and like what that they have plans for the bigger picture, the long run, by making it so we could buy wrap staked ohm on a much cheaper network and avoid these gas fees. But yeah, that's basically it for this video, guys. I hope you appreciated the uh, information and like the content. Feel free to like and subscribe. Peace.